Hello friends, in this video I'd like to solve the following problem from the International Mathematical Olympiad 1967 long-listed problem 48, proposed by Sweden. We wish to find all positive numbers x satisfying the, the equation x to the power of x equals square root of 2 over 2. So here are my hints for this problem. Uh, first, let f of x be equal x to the power of x investigate the limit as x goes to 0 of f of x and investigate the derivative of this function to see on which intervals is this function increasing and decreasing. And then try to guess some solutions and show that there are, there are no more solutions, which will close the problem. So give this problem a try and I will see you in just a minute. All right, so let's start by considering our function. So let f of x be equal x to the power of x for positive numbers. Notice that then, first, I will investigate the limit as x goes to 0 from the right-hand side of f of x. And classical trick to investigate this limit, I will write x to the power of x as e to the power x natural log of x. So it is e to the power limit as x goes to 0 from the right hand side x natural log of x. And to find this limit, uh, we will use the L'Hopital's rule. So limit as x goes to 0 from the right hand side of x natural log of x is the same as the limit as x goes to 0 of natural log of x over 1 over x, we can use the L'Hopital's rule. So it's 1 over x over minus 1 over x squared. So it's limit as x goes to 0 of minus x, which is 0. So our limit is e to the power of 0, which is 1. All right. And now let's investigate the derivative of our function f prime of x, once again, it's the derivative of e to the power x natural log of x. So it's e to the power x natural log of x, and using the chain rule, we'll have uh, now natural log of x plus x times the derivative of natural log of x, which is 1 over x. And e to the power x natural log of x is again x to the power of x times natural log of x plus 1. All right, and now let's see. Notice now that f of x, f prime of x is less than 0. For what x is? For x between 0. And what is the root of this equation? Well, 1 over e. 1 over e. Likewise, f prime of x is greater than 0 for x's from 1 over e to plus infinity. All right, so all in all, our function looks something like that. It attains its minimum of at 1 over a. At 1, it, of course, attains the value of 1. So the graph looks something like that. Something like that. All right. And now, finally, let's tackle our equation. So we have x to the power of x equals square root of 2 over 2. But notice that square root of 2 over 2, mm. this number is between 0 and 1. So from our graph, we can see that our equation has two solutions. Two solutions, because it's somewhere here. There are exactly two positive numbers satisfying the equation. All right, and now how can we find them? Well, the easiest way is to guess, because notice that square root of 2 over 2, it can be written as uh, 
uh, 1 over square root of 2, and 1 over square root of 2 is 1 half, to the power 1 half. So one solution is now visible. Uh, but also notice that 1 half to the power 1 half, we can write it as 1 fourth, 1 fourth to the power 1 fourth. Well, why is that? Because 4, because square uh, root of degree 4 of 4 is the same as square root of 2. So now we can clearly see our solutions. <laughs> solutions. Our solutions. X is either 1 fourth or 1 square or 1 half. So our equation has at most two solutions and we have found them. And that closes our problem. So thank you very much for watching and I will see you next time. Goodbye.